Alright, Retro Challengers, this is AR Fink, and I'm here to demo my plotter, which I finally got uh, running. Right now I have my, this is a, an HP Color Pro plotter. It has uh, an 8 pen carousel, and you load paper in and it slides the paper back and forth, and the pen goes in this carriage here. And the carousel, I only have one pen in here right now because I've only got one pen that really works. But you can put eight inside. And the pens look like this, they have little caps. Um, they fit really tight. I don't think I can get it off with one hand. Um, and I built a serial cable that connects from there to here, which then runs to my Linux computer. I have a serial terminal open right now, and I made up an image. Uh, one of my favorite websites is sdf.org. Their public access Unix system, they've been running for a really long time, and it's their 25th anniversary, and they made this really cool logo, and I decided I would try to print, or rather to plot that. So I've converted this logo um, into an HPGL file. And I'm going to use uh, Chiplotle, uh, which is a Python library for Linux, to push this HPGL file over the serial port to the plotter. So the first thing I have to do is load some paper in. So you put the paper in like that, up to, there's a white line there, you load it to the white line. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. Then you push the... Uh, uh, the pinch wheel button and it grabs onto the paper and since my HPGL generator uh, doesn't generate pen grabbing commands I need to force it to grab the pen as well so now it has a pen and over here I'm just gonna tell it to start drawing Go. Now you notice the output stops every so often. I have a little bit of a buffering problem where uh, the buffer will overflow and it'll just sit there. Um, and it's, it's not a problem with the plotter, it's a problem with the uh, control software on my computer. It just needs a little tweaking. But you'll notice the, uh, the result of the plotter stalling is you get these little blobs where the pen sits still for just long enough to bleed a little bit, so that'll need to be fixed, but overall it runs pretty well. I'm going to try to hold the camera steady here so that you can watch it plot.
And we're nearly done. Yep, all done. And there it is. Oh, give it back. There we go. Isn't it lovely? Well, till next time.